Hi and welcome back to Aikido Flow. Today on the show we're going to be looking at um, strikes and how to use them effectively. Uh, in Aikido we have what's called a temi, uh, which is not necessarily striking but it's the intention of striking. And today on the show we're going to have a look at this. So don't ever let anyone tell you that striking is not important in whatever martial art you're doing, whether it's Aikido, Jiu Jitsu, uh, any of them really, do you know what I mean? It's like, it's probably the most important thing. Uh, but coming from an Aikido point of view, uh, we call striking, it's called etemi. So it's, it's the art of striking really, uh, in a way that's economical and that's going to do the most amount of effective damage to your opponent as possible without destroying them of course it's a way of controlling your opponent the, so the first point is um, in our dojos we again we get into the habit of doing things that are not really realistic uh, like they would be on the street so first point um, making contact with the person is really important quite a lot of the time we will put a strike in in the dojo but we're not actually making any, any contact i know we're not we don't really want to be going around punching people in the face in the dojo but you can use things like open hand palm strikes and things just make contact with the person so it gets you used to actually you know getting the feeling of what it would be like to actually hit somebody but without you know hitting them hard and it's just a good way of feeling it and feeling the person there as opposed to just punching and not feeling anything there at all so that's point number one okay the second point i'm going to show a technique it's not necessarily a very effective technique but it's one that will allow me to show you what will happen you know just kind of i'm not going to actually make any contact with the strikes but i'm going to emphasize where the strikes should be roughly okay so he's coming in to grab okay strike here boom strike here strike there strike strike and then you know strike okay the third and final point i'm just going to show you roughly the same technique again um, with the actual striking the making the contact they don't have to be hard strikes in your training just get used to actually getting that contact it don't ask, doesn't have to be a full-on hammer strike but just get those points of contact and it will just it will kind of enhance your training and it will just improve your overall kind of awareness of about striking and it will hopefully train you to if, if god forbid anything did happen you'll know you'll be more accurate with your strikes more pre precise with your strikes and you'll just be overall more confident with your strikes so let's come to grab here look first strike here turn strike there strikes lots of strikes strikes here strikes strikes and one final strike with your knee boom and near away so hopefully that gave you some sort of insight into a temi training so in conclusion then, a temi, striking, you know, all that stuff is very important in our Aikido training and it's very important in other martial arts systems. You've got to know how to strike effectively and precisely and hopefully what I showed you there will give you kind of a little bit more of a, an idea of um, where to strike and how to strike. And it'll just make you a lot more confident as a martial artist and it'll just, you know, improve your overall awareness about striking. So I hope that's some help for you and we'll see you next time.